hi guys uh, today we are gonna be going over how to how to show a video and how to record a video and allow editing and stuff so let's go let's start by adding a few frameworks so add this mobile core this is for adding the uh, the camera thing and then we need to add two of this AV foundation and AV kit you need both of these if you want to play a video so let's start by just playing a video a simple video in our iOS so uh, so the we have to import these three frameworks now mobilecode.h hash import um, get AV uh, foundation okay and then and then when we do this part so now you have to make instantiate the AV player view controller star AV AV control let's say AV player view controller Alec So this is the view controller and then view controller has a player inside it so then you have to instantiate the player also set the player av control dot player now you have to say av player mm. av player player with url okay so we also have to set the url so how do you set the URL? So first we have to import a video to our project. So I have it on a desktop. I'm just gonna add it. Just copy any like MOV MP4 video from the internet and just add it over here. Okay, so once I've added it, it is just a simple video. What should you do if you experience a problem with Okay? I'm gonna go to the so what happens so when you make a project these all images and videos over here get stored in a bundle so we have to first access the bundle so we say ns url star url and we have to first make it of type ns string because it's going to be stored in a bundle so you have to first get the url of the bundle bundle main bundle path for resource of type once you get this part then you say ns url file url because it is a file so with part you now give url video now after this so this url goes to now url now you just say self present view controller av control animated yes completion mail now when the now when you open the video uh, now when you open the application the video should start playing guys so i copied my code from view did load to view did appear and now run your code now slowly working what should you do if you experience so a working. problem with your ipod remember these five basic suggestions so now we use this av player av player because because this av uh, player view controller can also be used in ipads for pip the picture in picture mode and all of those now let's make a camera so let's remove this code from over here or just comment it out we're going to use this code but let's just make it a button
and then we're gonna show the album with this okay so let's uh, make it out there. camera so I'm gonna UI image pick the controller start UI PC then you allocate it image package controller uh, alloc now we're gonna think like the it is it is like it is playing in camera it is playing in cell phone so you can access the camera so now you set the delegate UIPC dot delegate now you have to set the media type because we want to use the camera now like for recording so media types it takes in an array so you say array with object and in this one you have to make it of type n a string so you do like a type casting take you a movie Cut type we have to make it of type movie wait it's not as Oh, we have to connect our device and then we have to okay so now we let's so now my phone is connected and then and I'm gonna run it over here so the like, good time player I'm gonna move movie recording that's only that's only I'll close this in the middle for now so when I hit camera it is throwing an exception Guys, so the exception occurred because we use UIPC and not cell, so you have to hit cell. But still, this will not show the, uh, the picker controller, so you have to say UIPC dot UI image picker controller source type equals to UI image type source type camera. And then you have to present the controller. So let's see. You have to say source type. now when you hit camera now it should work so now it so now it can take recordings okay so now it works so now it will call delegate method link to it so then delegate method since you said the delegate this is the method which will be called when you are done taking the picture so now if you wish to like play the video just when you uh, 
done recording it so let's just copy the same code but we have to first self dismiss your controller publishing mail and this one instantiate the class but in this time we are not doing any ns string in the ns url you simply give url with string so in this one uh, it's not a url with string we have to do a type casting star and now you say now the again because the video is inside info so you say again info and we have to check it back so you run the application run the application and I'm gonna record the video So inside my info I should see the inside the info I should see this is my first one UI image picker controller media controller media media URL this is what I'm looking for okay so we stop the execution So now we're gonna start playing So now if you record a video So now you can play the video Then let's try to save the video So to save the video it has another method video path now to save the video this is the method but it takes in a in a string so now we have to convert this URL into a string so the way you do it is is URL path now this will return you an in a string and then you say nil comma nil yeah that's it Okay guys, so, so today we learned how to how to play a video, how to record a video and then play a video and then how to save a recorded video to your photos album. Okay guys, so if you if you like my video, surely share my videos and then subscribe to my channel. See you next time.